Ooh, 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 look at that guys. What's up? How's it going Mark Freeman 408? Down at the river having some fun. It is quite breezy up top and also apparently there's a mega storm coming. They're saying between 5 and 20 centimeters in certain places. So we wanted to get out, get after it. We're doing more photos again with Scott while the sun is shining. We got the old cannon down here. This is my sweet camera case. Isn't that awesome? The old 408 Carhartt sweater. But uh, yeah, so the photos with Chris turned out well, so we're just gonna bang out a few more. I was seeing the jump in a car today, but it's pretty freaking breezy up there. So maybe we'll just do some uh, some water skipping to the river here, or break through the ice. So Scott's got his little camping set up here. We're doing more fin trail photos. So Scott's got my gear on today. Hot chocolate maybe. Ooh, is it special? Why isn't this focusing? Did you break it? I guess we're not we're not focusing today. You're never really focused anyway, right, Scott? <laughs> never. But yeah, so as you can see, it is attempting to freeze. How thick is it? Yeah, oh. you, you be the judge of that. You got, uh, shoot, what do we got about almost a centimeter, give or take? Frickin' zoom. Oh, you're going right in there. You want that muddy water, right? I need the clean water. <laughs> How am I gonna do that? Look at that, that's some clean water. <laughs> you keep trying to zoom. Might have to restart my phone here. Anyways, we'll get this thing rigged up and we'll report back and then, uh, yeah, maybe skip the river, see what we can do. Here we go. There we go. He's out there deep now. I just had to accidentally the camera app and she's we focused fish now. Got the good, good? Got the good stuff. Look at this little fire, eh? You bring some hot dogs? Oh, ho, ho. You got an ice float in there. It's beautiful. This is how Scott makes his lunch. He goes down the river and... Every day. Every day. <laughs> Every day. Every day I'm day. Oh, man. My wood's tilting at a little bit. Like that. A little tilty wood. Yeah. Look at us. Full photography. Looking good there, Scott. Always. I think we should do some water skipping. I think it's going to be too too um, too windy up on the track. To, uh, I mean, we can jump it, but all you guys will hear is wind noise. So. You want me to skip across the water? Yeah, I want you to run really fast and skip across. I have been working on my sprint. Also, I'm going to try and skip the ra the river with the Maverick this uh, winter again. I think I'll, I'll try it with the studded tires, though, will get some more traction. <laughs> All right, let's bang out a few more photos and then go get the sled. We are golden. A couple photos. We got our model here. Okay, go get the snowmobile. Hopefully, there's some gas in it. If not, we might have to run the gas in. It's only 2 30. We got tons of time. I haven't skipped this uh, part of the river in a while since we saw it, so hopefully we don't sink today. And uh, yeah, we got the drone too, so we'll throw up the drone. Knock down some of these weeds.
grass. Uh, that was definitely a little tricky on the ice. It wasn't awful, but as I was going out, you could feel the back track, you know, getting caught, bouncing me around. And then once I got over there, I had to clear a path again. <laughs> so the grass is obviously that tall. So I kind of had a bit of a path in the summer. All good. But uh, just going to take a two second breather. Head back out. learning with the ice and now you can see the ice is broken and it is kind of floating down the river so shouldn't get in my way too much I feel like I've turned half of it into slush but I'm glad it more wore my rain suit because <laughs> I knew it was gonna get wet especially when you do those straight up wheelies the water shoots forward and then you come down and drive straight through it so it actually feels pretty good on the face coming back though it's hard to see with the Sun so I think the first time I ended up going landing kind of you know about 50 feet past where i wanted to but uh then i realized you know where you were and whatnot so yeah she's going well and i got a nice little path over there but yeah since now the ice is broken it's way easier i would way rather go way up the river but the water is starting to drop so you can see well not really right here but the rock oh sorry I think burp. <laughs> swallowed too much water the rocks are poking out so you do smell like the thames right now that's, it's good, right? Yeah, so it's, it's nice. Cologne. It's yeah. a good musk. So let's throw up the old Skydio drone and get some yeah. cool shots. Free car wash for the yeah, yeah. the ski. Yeah, and uh, it's for a slide. great it's a great lawnmower too. I don't know if you saw much uh, yeah. of these weeds I took. You were bringing a bunch of them. 
This could be our new camping spot. Right I like it. Bring down a tent, get my stove going. Yeah, sure. We're good. Let's keep the party going. <laughs> Sunker. I hope you got that. I did. You see what happened? No. So I wheelied. Oh, came down. My handlebars were wet, the rubber, and of course my gloves are rubber. And my hand just snapped like full wrist. Oh, oh. And so my hand came completely off the throttle. I almost stopped. And right where I was is probably one of the deepest parts. Anyways, I'm like, well, I'm done. So I freaking grabbed a handful and somehow pulled out of it. But, you know, it's always that last time. Got to do one more run, one more run. Oh, man. But, uh, no, I made it to shore. My wrist hurts a little bit, but that's fine. Just kind of jammed it. Did it look scary from your side? Super scary. Super, were you scared? I was worried. It looks like you peed yourself a little. I did. A little it looks dribble. like I peed all over myself. You that's definitely peed feel. yourself. River water. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, I made it, but you know what that means. It's time to shut it down. So, uh, yeah, let's head up to the house and uh, go dry off. Let's do it. We survived. It is chilly. It's quite windy up here, so that's why we decided not to jump the garden today because this is a little sheltered here, but over there, it's wide open. Here, so, it might have jumped. He's got ice freezing all over me. I'm actually pretty warm. These fin trails. Ice everywhere. Like all, these aren't insulated. All I have is a hoodie on underneath. And yeah, I'm quite warm. Oh, I'm glad that went okay. My hand did slip off. These are just some, some Home Depot gloves or whatever I got them. And yeah, we're good. Hope you enjoyed the video. We'll try and get something jumped soon. Like I said, big storm hitting us tomorrow, so I hope we'll be able to film for the next few days because it's going to be so windy and stormy. But thank you guys again. Make sure you follow Scott. Don't follow Scott. Do whatever you want. <laughs> we'll see you later.